Well, if you're driving Sorry. into downtown Raleigh this afternoon, you'll see what's being called Raleigh's tallest mural. Yeah, I think you can miss it. It's at Hargan at McDowell Street. CBS 17's Joseph Holloway joining us live right now with why artists in the community leaders say this is a big deal for downtown, both literally and figuratively, Joseph. Yeah, that's definitely right, Bill and Liz. You know, this project is nearly three years in the making, and you can see where it is now a done deal. This is the seven story mural right here at the ATT building. This is right across from Nash Square. And the Raleigh Murals project that's behind this piece of art showing a tree made of triangles, with the tree representing, of course, our nickname, the City of Oaks. Raleigh Mayor Marianne Baldwin, it, she mentioned how people in Nashville wait in lines to take pictures and front of murals. She's hoping for that right here, especially with this one. And Jedediah Gant with the Raleigh Murals Project agrees, saying that he hopes that this is going to bring more attention to this part of downtown. People just drove past this building and wouldn't notice it. And a lot of the people I know would say, like, that's the ugliest building in Raleigh, or worst building in Raleigh. And I would say, no, it's the best mural, or best, best building in Raleigh for a mural. Now, the Raleigh Murals Project says that it has designed around 80 to 90 murals in just the past six years. Live in downtown Raleigh, Joseph Holloway, CBS 17 News. Definitely a beautiful mural. I love all the shades of green in it. Really cool. I'm excited to see it in person. Yeah. Joseph, thanks so much.